Good day everyone. This day we're going to learn dividing two digit number by three digit number. So let's have an example. Six hundred fifty divided by twenty five. So in dividing two digit numbers by three digit numbers, there is a process that we're going to use. Divide, multiply, subtract, and repeat. So this process can be used also in dividing a one-digit number. So this time, let's have this example of us. 650 divided by 25. So let's identify first which is the dividend and the divisor 650 is our dividend which is inside the table of our division so 600 and 25 is our divisor which will be on the outside of the table so Let's divide this by following our process. First thing is divide. Now let's divide the two digit number from the dividend to 25. Let's look how many 25 or let's imagine how many 25 there is in 65. If we're going to estimate it, we can do like this. 25 times 2 is we're going to see um, 25 times 2 is 50. If we're going to make it 25 times 3, it will become 75 and it's over already from 65. So we're going to use 2. And 2 times 25 or 25 times 2 is 50. That's our second process. Now the third process is subtract. 5 minus 0 is 5, and 6 minus 5 is 1. And then let's bring down 0. Now, if we're going to look to the next process, which is division, how many 100, how many 25 there is in 150? If we're going to count it. 25 times 6, it will be 150. So the answer is 6. And then 6 times 25 is 150. And our final answer is 26. That's for our example number 1. Example number 2. For the example number 2, this one will be more complicated. Sample number 2 is 715 divided by 37. Oops. 37. Our 715 is our dividend which is inside the table. So I want you to remember that guys because it's very important which is the dividend and which is the divisor. 37 is our divisor. Now, since this is a two-digit number, we can use the two-digit number in the dividend to estimate how many 37 in 71. Now, let's see. 37 times 2, it will become 74. So, it's already over from 71. So, we will use 1 as our estimate on how many 37 there is in 71. Now, 1 times 37, which is the second process. So, the answer is 34. And then, bring down 5. Now, let's estimate how many 37. Let's use again division. 345 divided by 37. Let's estimate how many 37 there is in 345. 
So, 37 times E it is 56 times 3 is 24 plus 5 is 29. So, we can still add 37 to 296. So, let's make it 9. So, it is um, 9 times 7 is 54. Hmm, is it 54? Students? Of course not. 9 times 7 is 63. 9 times 3 is 27 and plus 6 is 33. So the answer is 333. If we're going to make it 10, it will be over from 345. So the answer is 9. Then 9 times 37, the next process is 333. So 1 and then 2. So the answer is 19 remainder 12. This is our final answer. So that's it for today, students. I hope you learned something today. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe.